All right, thank you for joining me for another video. This one's just going to be uh, one about the detailing knife that I picked up a couple months back. I did a video on it, um, unboxing, so I'll leave that in the description below. And also, at the end of this video, I'll try to remember to link it there so you can check it out if you want. Um, this is the Beavercraft detailing knife. It's a budget-friendly knife, and I've had really good uh, use of it so far. Cannot complain. Um, I'm used to using a bigger one like this, kind of your average whittling knife. Um, this one's a cheaper one, the more uh, you see in other videos. And if you follow the channel, you already know this, but nothing special. But this got me through a lot of carvings and really didn't notice how hard it would be to do detailing until I picked up this detailing knife and then found how much easier it is to really get in those precise areas and just give some spots a little bit cleaner finish and by no means do you need it but I would highly recommend at least picking one up to try it out see if you do like it or it improves your cutting whittling um, this one I'll leave a link for this one I bought in the description below I got it off Amazon 12 or 13 bucks. I have Prime, so at that time at least this was listed for free shipping. And definitely a cheap, budget friendly knife to get. But I haven't had, had any issues. I keep mine pretty sharp. Um, it comes really sharp already, but if I have like a big carving I'm doing, I'll occasionally just sharpen it on the uh, little weather here with the green the green uh, block there compound there you go didn't think of the name but if I'm just doing a small like owl thing or something I'll just do it at the end just kind of keep it precise and sharp but handle wise it's really nice still no issues there and like I said the blades held up nice um, so no complaints there and for the price, I would certainly suggest you pick one up yourself because you can try it if you really like the detailing knife. Maybe you go ahead, use this till it's um, no longer good for you and then you can just upgrade from there. But otherwise, um, I couldn't tell you the lifespan of this, how like well it holds up over a long period of time. But just for, you know, the three or four months, whatever it's been for me, it's been really good. So highly recommended. Um, they don't pay me or anything, not a sponsor, but just to give you guys that feedback. So if you are new to whittling and you only have the one knife deal like I've had for a long time, cheap, easy, uh, fix right here with getting some of those precise detailing things you want to get done on your carvings. So if you have any questions, feel free to ask below in the comment section. I'll try to get to those as soon as I see them, but other than that, go check out the unboxing video if you have not yet seen that. And maybe that will kind of make or break if you want to pick up this one or not. There's a whole bunch of detailing knives for company-wise. So I just happened to pick Beavercraft because I knew of the name. And it was a fairly cheap knife so for what it is. But again, appreciate you guys uh, checking out the video. Hopefully you guys have a great weekend. And thank you for watching again. And I will see you guys in the next video.